And we're in Tokyo, so where else would Katie go but the French bakery? Stay up, Chicago. Have to have that. Oh, wow. I think that's uh, probably about year of the year. The girl loves bread. So now that we have bread, our second stop of the morning is the Meiji Shrine in Yoyogi Park, right in the middle of Tokyo. It's just gorgeous. This city is awesome. <laughs> she doesn't like the shirt. Oh, Where are you from? Oregon State. You went to OSU? Okay, you can give me Go Beefs. Go Beefs. <laughs> This is unbelievable. It's so quiet and so beautiful. I cannot believe this is the middle of Tokyo. This temple is to Emperor Meiji and his consort. It's a Shinto shrine, which is the original ancient Japanese religion that's more uh, about being in tune with nature. Really interesting. Well, the Meiji Shrine was awesome and tranquil and peaceful. Now we're gonna head into the super hip shopping district of Takashita Dori. See that right? Yep, sounds like. Fair enough. I can understand why some parents would be horrified. There's this, and then there's this. I don't see the problem. <laughs> Crepes are the famous street food here in Harajuku. This is an anime clothing store. Wow, I love this store, it's so cool. I'm gonna take all of this back. Check these guys out. Harajuku is, and Takashita Dori is an awesome place to go if you want to see fashion, like uh, particularly anime fashion. People are just dressed really cool. They're doing the news in anime. Now we're going to explore the biggest electronic store in Tokyo, and we're in the Akihabara district. Doors of Electronics Bliss. Coolest store ever, and we're only halfway up. I want it. I want it all. It's amazing. They even have the SS Yamoto from Star Blazers. That was the best cartoon ever. Our first vending machine, our sweat. Gotta have it when it, you're dehydrated. Vending machines are apparently central to life in Tokyo. We're wandering west and north from Akibara Station in search of the hardcore anime and manga culture. This is supposed to be the hot spot for it. The hawkers for the cosplay and manga place just all over the roads is really interesting. There are thousands of people playing Pokemon Go all over the place. What do you think of this area? It is weird but actually cool at the same time. Right behind us is the area affectionately known as Piss Alley. It's by the Shinjuku train station right along the tracks. Plus there's some alleys with a bunch of great little local places to eat in there. So we are going to go find some food. favorite place we've been yet in Tokyo. It's pretty cool. And that's saying something because Tokyo is awesome. I can't
can't remember the Japanese name of the place we just ate, but I'll put it probably right there. That was cool. Little dive places in that whole alley. Mostly locals there, some expats running around. There's a giant Godzilla peeking over the buildings right there. What you don't hear? Horn honking. I don't think we've heard a single horn honk since we've been in Tokyo. It's yeah. quite the relief. <laughs> the best phone case ever. Yet another reason I love this trip. If you like our video, leave the thumbs up and subscribe. So now that was good.